Hi, hey, and all those other greetings, Spade Adventures. I'm Jake Spins, welcoming you guys back to my gaming and unboxing channel, where today we will be joining back up with the Super Mario Maker 2 Story Mode Let's Play. So, that's pretty exciting, but before we jump into story mode, we have a few things to do, and a few things to say, and one of those things to say is that I have a second channel called Jake Spins Originals that you guys can check out that has script stories like Girl of Cyclones, Quincor, and Florelei, as well as having some old vlogs and having art videos. So, let's jump in to the second thing, which is... I made a new level! Yay! <laughs> Don't know why I made that, uh, that weird, very quiet, screamy type noise. I don't know. I don't know if I'd call it scream or not. And, uh, either way, I'm hoping that there's a, uh, there's a view notification. There is a view notification, because it's been a few days. And right, Shattuck ended up playing it and getting the world record, so that's pretty, pretty nifty. And, oh, he left a comment, so hopefully, <laughs> hopefully that is, that is a good comment. Um, but he did tell me that he thought it was pretty fun, so thank you, uh, Shattuck, for that. And let's see, so five likes, not bad, and two clears. So, wow, that one guy that liked it and Shattuck are the only two people that have cleared this level. That's crazy, but it, it's gotten five likes already. Oh, and Hoppin' Boppin' Hill has five. That's that's interesting. But uh, this is my newest level, so if you guys want to play Froggy slash... I always call it Froggy. Frogger slash Crossy Road, then uh, feel free to check this out because I think it's it's pretty interesting. Hey, he said cool idea. I, I appreciate it. As I said before in the stream, it's a little bit gimmicky, but I think that it's it's a pretty nice... Fun and well-rounded level. So, uh, yeah, feel free to check it out. Alright, so we are back into the actual story mode where we can jump, jump. Jump up in the air. Jump without a care. I, I, it's been so long, I don't remember. I need to listen to Jump Up Superstar like a hundred times to re-remember the, <laughs> the lyrics. But, uh, anyway, I think we do actually have something in progress and we just need to go a little further or we need some more coins or something it's been a little bit but uh let's go to the impassable castle by father of name withheld <laughs> this castle is protected by thwomps and chain chomps there's no way mario is getting through well unless he figures out that he can pick up buzzy shells with Y and tilt down to wear them as helmets, because as Bowser, I am clearly a tutorial fairy named Navi. <laughs> but that ain't gonna happen. Thanks, Navi Bowser. Just picturing a tiny little Bowser with little fairy wings going, Hey, listen! <laughs> Can I, can I even make these jokes when I've only played, like, two Zelda games? I don't know, but I'm doing them anyway. Um, but, uh, speaking, speaking of Odyssey, and, uh, if you guys haven't seen that, I've done a playthrough, so I'm allowing myself to talk about Odyssey spoilers because it's on the channel and it's, it's watchable. But, um, in, oh god! <laughs> that, yep, I don't know what I expected. Yeah, okay, but in Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games, there's been a new trailer. That's, that's neat. There's been a new trailer that they showed showing Dream Karate. I know Dream Events are going to be in this, and that is super exciting to me. Like, I am extremely excited about that. And the Dream Karate is actually going to be the Mushroom Kingdom from, uh, from Odyssey, and it's going to have the little Cappy ship. <laughs> the little uh, Cappy ship in the background, which I think is pretty neat. All right. We're going to bounce this guy. Come on. No, you can't. How, how do I 
get him up there? I don't know. Why did it work that time? Was it a full hop instead of... Ah. Do I missed. There we go. I got him. Hey, look at that. Look at me being pro. All right. Bet you can't get this. Hey, you can't get this. Hey, we taunt him. And she take our hat. Our hat is dead. Rip hat. We get hat cousin. But I, na I do not name hat cousin because we have named way too many things in this playthrough. <laughs> but uh, note to self, your hitbox when you have shelmet can actually go past the shelmet and be a problem. So just, uh, just be careful about that. Whoa, okay. Let's not be too rambunctious. Rambunctious. Is this really a good spot for, for coins? This is, this is rude. But tempting. Oh, I still got it. Was that Mario or was that my little my little shell? You know how those people have that, that bucket that they carry? Mario has it upside down. So, you know, there, there's that. Wait, how are you supposed to get that? How? You can't throw this upwards. Can I maybe... No. I don't know. Something with this thump, maybe? But, because the chain trump, that's not going to work. Okay, well that was a bad idea on my part, and I no longer have a shelmet. the sad the sad irony oh and now I don't have a shelmet I bet I can't get that 10 coin now can I have a shelmet what excuse Nintendo <laughs> this is rude on the highest caliber of rude whoa no okay that's even more rude that's yep yep and there's just it's a ten coin that we need mushroom for so uh you know but it's okay because now we get to uh get our anger out with this change up. that was bad that was that was bad mushroom kingdom one-on-one one-on-one -on -one. no mushroom kingdom 101. Don't be stupid with your shelmets. Because if you are, you're gonna die. That's not a threat. That's just saying that the shell will come back to haunt you. Uh, but yeah, I think, I think we actually did, yeah, yeah. That's why I just played a level either way, because I was like, I think we have to to build the main roof. So yeah, there we go with 99 cents. So if anybody has a good 99 cent store, let me know, cause uh, that would be helpful. Cool, more jabs from the construction. But the question is, is there more things to do over here? No, it looks like that's a no. Oh, that's now a, that's nice. Well, we can afford more than a uh, 99 cent store. We can afford a dollar and 11 cent store now. Minus tax. It's a problem with the, with a dollar store though. So they're like, but uh, yeah, there's gonna be tax on that. So, you know, <laughs> it's like, God dang it. Lava Bubble Limbo by a certain mage. So we had um, Bowser and now Kamek. All right, so here we go. Let's see if I can do a Kamek voice. <laughs> I created an ocean of lava bubbles, but now I can't get through it. Someone please get through this pot for me. I'll pay you. Kamek, you can, you can turn walls into different things by your magic. 
and you can just change the lava bubbles. Can can Kamek change the lava bubbles into different things? I don't know. Wait, it's a lot. Oh my god, it's a water level. You know what though? I I actually I said this on stream, but you know I do need some inspiration for water levels. So maybe this isn't a bad thing. Oh, you know what? That's actually not that bad a concept. That's kind of that's kind of neat. You got the lava and the cheap cheeps. And, you know, maybe auto-scrolling water level is a smart idea because there's only so much you can do in a water level. And I'm, I especially need help with the Mario World style because that's stuff that I'm actually using. I can't say too much. But, um... Okay, I'm sorry, but I had to skip that. Oh, my gosh, it was probably a mushroom, too. And I just completely derped because I'm greedy. Greedy as heck. Oh, God. Okay. Um, but, yeah, this will be helpful because I really... I just don't know how to make water levels. And I don't I don't know why that is. But... Especially in, um, in Mario World. Because the thing is, it takes away that whole idea of you having the spin jump. And that's the biggest issue with it, is that for Mario 3 and all that... You know, Mario 3, Mario Brothers, you don't have those mechanics, but having the mechanics to where you could use it, but you're underwater so you can't, kind of hinders it a little bit, and it makes it a little bit frustrating. Whereas, that being said too, I feel like when you get into the later games, you have so many different options and so many pretty kinds of backgrounds for like Mario U and Mario 3D World. So it's not something to really worry as much about. But Mario World, it's just it's just not as not as good. Also, lava bubbles apparently will give you one ups if they're by the goals. So that's kinda cool. I didn't think about that, because they're technically enemies. They act like objects, but they're they're enemies. You know, I, I feel like it would suck to be a lava bubble though, because you'd be warm all the time because they're sentient. It's not something you'd think would be sentient, but oh, in Mario, you bet that red hot fire, that is sentient. Uh, I wasn't I wasn't sure where I was going with that. But anyway, though, Dry Bones Lava Lurker by the Young Trina. Sorry, I, I was dreaming a bit. Anyway, though, I got Maker's Block, so I added some Dry Bones out of desperation. Pretty sure it's too hard now, though. Can someone defeat all of these dry bones and make it to the finish line? Mine to the lava now. Wait, mine the lava? I don't know why, but whenever I think dry bones, I always think of, you know, like desert. Well, that's because dry bones would generally work very well in desert, but they're usually in a castle. All right, it's looking like a World 3 castle. <laughs> Not World 3. Mario Brothers 3. Alright, I mean, I would have been okay with, uh... You know. Oh, wait, you have... Oh. I see, I see now. I get it. I understand. <laughs> gonna die in the amount of time, though. Well, I, you know, I'm gonna die. I know it's inevitable. So, I might... Might as well get as many coins as possible. Yeah, you'd think that dry bones would just die from that, but, you know. Okay, that actually freaked me out, even though I knew it was coming. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, Mario just died out of thin air. And that, well, it was mostly the vibration that didn't help. But, you know, it's, it's fine. Let me, let me tail you. Let me hit you with my tail feather. What, what, what is that from? Like, it's like shake your tail feather or something. It's like supposed to be like a dance thing. Well, I know what it's supposed to be. I probably shouldn't be talking about it on this, but you know, it's, it's whatever. Boop. I would have done the Ryu car wait for the last second, but I was like, nah, I don't want to risk it and have another stupid death because we have a death counter. Yeah. And in editing, every single time, and I bet you it's going to happen this episode, I always start 
I forget about the death counter, then I die and I'm like, shoot, I need to go to a previous episode, I need to copy the death counter, so then I have to save the episode that I'm working on, and then get the death counter and add it and actually make sure there's no extra things. But I'm actually not sure where the death counter's at, I just know by episode 3 it just got sad. <laughs> That's all I remember. All right. Blinking Block Blitz. Isn't this like the fourth level we're on? That's, that's great. Well, that's normal for this. But the third level was like really short. All right, by, this is by Dr. Gizmo. Hmm. 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 I've augmented a cliff with blinking blocks. I need a test subject to attempt to climb up the blocks and make it to the end. The red and blue blocks switch back and forth, so pay attention to the timing. I don't know why I went Smash Brothers announcer at the end, but hey, you know, sometimes you, you just gotta go Smash Brothers announcement. An announcement. Well, speaking of Smash Brothers announcement, I'm very excited about the new characters that are going to be added. And again, I will I will say this till the end of time. I called it. I will be 90, and I will be like. I called the fact that there was going to be more DLC characters for Smash Brothers Ultimate. And my children will be like, we know, Grandpa. They're already on, like, the 50th installment of Smash Brothers. Like, it's it's fine. Like, cool that you called it, but, uh, please stop. And I'm going to be like, but I called it. And everybody said I was wrong. And they're going to be like, Grandpa, pl please, just for the love of God... But I will, I will never let it go. I'm just always, always going to be super happy about it. But, um, I'm, I'm super happy about it mostly because it's like, it brings up so many more possibilities. Because I know people are like, oh, Shantae is a spirit, so Shantae won't happen. But the only thing that is deconfirmed is Goku, Iron Man, any type of character that is not an actual, like, that has not or uh, had an origin inside of video games. That is the only con confirmation that we actually have. So there is nothing stating that, hey, you know, spirits can't be. And I know I talk about this, but there's a lot of characters they can seriously do. You know, they've got Shantae, you can have Rayman, because I know a lot of people were hoping for that after the Rayman leak. I mean, I, I know why, but... <laughs> you know, that, that whole leak thing ended up making people want it more. But it, it just opens up so much possibility, and it's kind of nice not having to worry about, like, oh, what's going to be the next DLC thing? And being like, oh, it's probably going to be this when... Now we know it's just straight up going to be Smash, and just hope that eventually... <laughs> Even though I love Smash, Mario Maker will hopefully eventually get the treatment. Also, just thought about it, and uh, yeah, we're on a timer. So I need to be quick. <laughs> I need to be quick. Grabs five coins. As Bubsy once said. <laughs> no, no, I'm not, go I'm not going the Bubsy route. Considering I don't even like Bubsy. I mean, I've, I've never played the game, so, you know, I have to be fair in that aspect, but... There we go! The The nice thing is, we did get the Tale of Goalpost. So, yeah! The Mario, the Mario, yeah! Was very, very appropriate. I guess, I guess maybe I should do, like, you know, a whole thing. Like, if I have Fire Flower, say, like, Fire of Goalpost. <laughs> You know, Tale of Go Post would work for a few other ones, though. So there's that. Rotten Produce. Oh, boy. Did I work with Rotten Produce the other day when I was sweeping at my job? I've, I found a banana that was so ripe. It was ripe, like, twice. The whole peel was completely black, and you could just tell just from sweeping that it was, like, completely mushed, and it was really gross. Not as gross as, like, the moldy peach that I found that literally just sweeping it up made it just crack. It's like, why? 
But anyway, though, we have the world-renowned chef who is dealing with rat burgers. I don't understand why, but okay. Well, the good news is that I left a package of super mushrooms in the back of my refrigerators, and they went bad. The bad news is that there's no good news. And I stuck all of those rotten mushrooms in this course. Sorry. Wow, thanks. I love how they say super mushrooms, but you'd think they'd say one-up mushrooms, because that's what they come from. Not super mushrooms. Your Intel Nintendo is wrong. And you made the game, so that makes it even more confusing. Oh, wait, now that I think about it, is it just the one that's going to come out? Because it's also Red Pipe. need to remember also that it is the new U formula, and it's nighttime, so everything's going to be wacky. Yeah, but your one super mushroom turned out fine. No. Guys, we've got we've got a party. Woo! Woo! Look at this party. Look at this rotten party. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look at the dance. It's a me, a Mario, dancing to the rat the mushrooms. Woohoo. I have no idea. How many people did I offend? Let me know in the comments down below. All right, I was not taking the risk there. Okay, 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 no! Okay, it's fine, I had a, I had a soup. I had soup for breakfast, so it's, it's fine. I mean, I didn't actually, but you know, Mario himself had soup. Wait, why are these here? That's the real question. Why doth fly? It's the second time I've said doth, but you know, it's, it's whatever. But why doth you fly? Okay, okay. Gotta find out. Is this a... No, that's a mushroom. I was hoping it would be a flower. So we can try to get a uh, fire of goalpost. Okay. Don't be rotten. Don't look now, but there's a rotten, rotten thing coming right at you. Pikachu. And woo! That's just goalpost. <laughs> that's just that's just the top of the flagpole, you know. <laughs> Nothing special. No fancy, ridiculous memeage. It it is just what it is. The goal. All right, and that should leave us at ninety percent. Ninety. I can predict the future. <laughs> All right, and we have so many levels left to go. Like, what the heck, man? 90% done with the castle, and look at all of these levels. Oh, they have these ones on here, too. Well, I wish I would have known that. Then I could have just been checking these. Okay, well, I at least feel better now. I don't. I can't promise we'll play every single one of these levels, but I, I'm going to try to. <laughs> Alright, Koopa Clown Car Coin Collecting. By, again... Dr. Gizmo, who wants us to grab 50 coins. It's okay, man. Okay. I'm thinking about buying a certified pre-owned Koopa Clown car. Can someone test drive this Koopa Clown car and try to get 50 coins? Watch, there's going to be exactly 50 coins. And it's going to be upsetting. Because I want more than 50. Because I'm greedy! Yeah, it's just 50. God dang it. Hashtag, let me be greedy. Well, I guess it is technically letting me be greedy. What's up with these short levels where they're like, do the thing. Do it. All right, and I bet I have to stomp on you. Oh, okay. Okay, I probably have to jump on bullet bill. Oh my, God. this is obnoxious. Why? Oh, my God. Why couldn't you just give me the Koopa Clown car, man? How? How? Why? Oh. Oh, of course. Of course. I thought it was forcing me to have to destroy it. Get out of my way. Do not sandwich me. I'm just a poor Mario. Who wants to get all of the coins? 
You know? It's it's for a wedding anniversary gift, yeah. <laughs> I'm giving I'm giving my wife fifty coins. And she can buy whatever the heck she wants, because honestly, I haven't been paying attention that much. <laughs> you know? So Oh my god, stop! Just let me get my anniversary gift. It's one more coin. There we go. No! I want it to be big. You know what? I don't care. I don't care. If I want it to be big, then I can- No, you jerk! Wait, what? Uh... <laughs> wait, wait. Is that so it doesn't crush you to kill you when you're at the goal? Mario will teleport if he is crushed at the goalpost. That's wild! They've, they thought of everything. They legitimately thought of everything. Alright, so that's the roof completed. So, I mean... Well, that was 1%. What... Well, you know what? We're going to find out what happened with the sadness in the next episode. But you know what? 91%, despite having a lot of pages of flows to play, but 91% is not bad at all. I'd say it's pretty darn good. Anyway, though, guys, if you enjoyed this episode, make sure to hit that like button. Share this out with everybody you know and love. Brother, mother, sister, father, iguana. And if you have yet to play my new level, which I know because there's 7 billion people in the world. So you might be somebody who has not tasted the greatness of Frogger and uh, Mario Maker. I almost said some Smash Bros. That would be way harder to replicate. <laughs> Just saying. Or easier, because there's more motion, but like trying to fight it. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not making Frogger inside of Smash. <laughs> Let's just leave it at that. But uh, anyway, if you guys want to play Frogger, then there's the level code for all of you guys to check out. And that's going to be it for me. So if, I mean, I said all this stuff. So feel free to check out the level and keep your toes safe. Thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you want to see more from this channel, make sure to go to the left of the screen for subscribing and subscribing to my other channel and go to the right of the screen to check other videos. All right, see you guys later. Bye.